All right, good afternoon, cyber traders. Welcome back for a nice quick little afternoon. How's everybody doing? Good, good, good. All right, so um, <laughs> uh, Michael, man, good for you. Michael C., look at that. Michael just private chat to me. He didn't want to break too much, but he said he traded MBOT. Had a very good day for me today, and I'm in and out of seven trades. He made up to 5,000 so far. In MBOT, my God. Let me bring up that little chart over there. MBOT, look at that. Let's bring it up. Uh, we got to fix the time frame over here. Let me fix this thing right here. And uh, where's our MBOT? There we go. Waiting for data. Yeah, MBOT was just a phenomenal. Up 68% today. Guys, look at the big percentage gainers on the left-hand side. I mean... Look, look, 192%, 111%. I mean, look at the, that one. They got a scratch. That doesn't count. The MMOT, the SAVA. I mean, we could just go down the list. The, I, the ITCI was hands down, was the best trade this morning. You know, we did the morning meeting. I was logged in early. I told everybody about it in the pre-market. And what was that? When we were trading at roughly, what, $22? It ran to $45. You guys killed it killed it on that and it was just like i mean i'll tell you i i put in a chat room today was probably one of the best days in the history of i've done this in 25 years that a day before the, uh christmas eve that it was that good i thought it was gonna be bad you never know you show up look but and a lot of people that come to work today they're probably worried about trying to catch up christmas shopping you know what for the money you made go buy somebody else something nicer go buy him something nicer for the holidays whatever you're looking to do but let me tell you 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 know what you would never even think it would be that great. And it just doesn't stop there. I mean, we have that one. SAVA. Look at that this morning. Let me bring up that one. That one was just, look at that. 260 to $4. I mean, give me a break. Where do you find that? FSM. I mean, this one was really slow. Uh, that one didn't do about it. The MBOT. I mean, all of them. It was just like the list kept going on and on and on and on. And you know what? There's a couple other ones that are making some nice little moves right now that I want to put on the watch list too. I mean, look at look at SAVA, 58%. This one I knew right away. Um, it was very very slow. Stock hit a major cap. We said it was, I told you there was a huge resistance levels at like 67 cents, uh, 367. Did exactly what we anticipated. Okay. Now there are a couple other ones that are moving this morning. Um, that are also doing pretty uh, uh, this afternoon. That are doing pretty well. We need to keep an eye on it. Um, you know, you got to wait for the market just to kind of pan out a little bit. We got this one also that came came from nowhere. SSI up 24 percent. The only concern I have is the volume is quite low and the spread is quite ugly. So it is very important that you learn how to spread trade because you know this thing I was just trying to trade. I just got out. I bought it. I broke even because um, I chased it. And, um, you know, it backed off on me, but, you know, I broke even on it. I'm going to buy it. I might consider buying it back, but I want to see it break a new higher high. That one, the, uh, the MBOT, we're going to throw back this back on the watch list. Why the hell not? I mean, trade, everything's trading at the highs of the day. DRRX, another one, a little cheapy right here. Not too bad, 23%. Uh, 290 to, two, you know, 299, big, big seller hovering right at three bucks. I want to see if it breaks that. Once again, look at the long-term chart. Great. NLTX, another one. Trading at the highs. We all know this one very well. Look at this stock. $4. Not only been a, it's a great day trade, it's been a great swing trade. It's already at 13 I mean, the list goes on and on and on. Now, the, uh, the ITCI, guys, I, I think it's pretty much over. We'll, let's see if it holds here, but this thing is like a level five, okay? But, um, but there was just, I mean, the list just went on. And I don't know if I missed any of them. But the list, oh, we, I, the list kept going on and on and on. There was a buyout, too. Uh, yeah, this one I did pretty well on. The CDB, this one was a buyout. Uh, the buyout was at 350 What was it? I forgot what it was. 1050 And for some reason, it ran all the way to, like, 1057 Right around here, if you remember, right at 10 o'clock. That was a nice little move right there. But then it came right back down. That one, you know, I traded a few thousand shares. That one worked out pretty well. But uh, but overall, it's been a great great morning. Everyone did great, and now we got to trade the afternoon. Oh, even the uh, even the RAD did, did well, right? R8 um, Rite Aid. That was not only a great day trade, but this thing's been a phenomenal swing trade. Look at that bad boy. That thing just took off. We did great on that stock. 
And uh, the LK I almost forgot too. LK was also pretty good, uh, breaking all time highs. Obviously, you know the new China deal, you know that's going on. You know what? what? What did I say this morning? Does everybody remember what I said this morning? For all those haters out there, just short the market. Just short it. What do you got to lose? So we're up 100 points today. We're up 100 points. We're at 28. Listen, short the market. If you're really that negative, just short it. You know, why not make money? All right. Let me know how that's going to work after all those. <laughs> a lot of haters out there, Ken. A lot of haters. And you know what? Personally, it's it's not being political. They just they just they it's nothing about being political. Personally, they're just jealous. They didn't get in when they're supposed to, and they want the market to have like a nice Christmas crash so they can jump in now. You know, because there were a lot. Remember that was a great screaming buy on some of those stocks. That's really what it comes down to it. They just like, they, they don't know if they want to buy it now. You know what I mean? Like, God, do I jump in now? Do I jump in now? They, they want a correction. They want the stock to go down so they could buy it. They just, they hate it. But personally, I think we're going to get a short squeeze, you know? And then, right, Jerry, we're going to have the January earnings soon. Listen, unless there's a big, uh, you know what? Listen, you tell me why the market's going to go down. You got, you got UM, UM, a, 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 UM, a, uh, U.S. MCA just got uh, that sold. Look, there's going to be over a quarter million jobs going to come in. You got the China deal is going to come in. All these tariffs are coming off, which brought down the market. You got so much good news that's going to come out. I don't know what else is going to be that could do it unless, I mean, God forbid, you know, Korea like launches a, a missile, you know, they said on Christmas and, you know, that could throw a whole wrench into it. I don't know. But, um, but anyway, there's been great opportunities out there. So hopefully you guys did great. You know, it's been a great, great, uh, I tell you, it's been a great, probably one of the greatest Mondays I've seen in a long time. But doing this right before Christmas is just hands down unbelievable. Anyway, so you got your watch list. You got your you made some money today. You know what? We got tomorrow too. All right, just guys, be there early, okay? Be there early. I log in at at 7:45. What's gonna possibly hurt you? But anyway, congratulations to all the cyber traders and all you. And remember what I always say: if you didn't get in, you could always just buy one share and just say you were in it. It's a lot better than trading on demo mode. Good luck, everyone. Happy trading, and uh, enjoy the rest of the evening, and let's see what we could do going to this close. Bye-bye.